Hello and welcome. Don't change that dial. Sit back, relax, and enjoy the Trixie Show. Hey guys, this is Trixie, and I'm at Tanglewood Street House, and we're looking for the ghost of Ruth Brown. As always, we need to figure out what kind of ghost she is, use a motion sensor, prevent her from hunting with a crucifix, and get her to walk... Hello, cat. Uh, sorry, my cat just jumped on my arm. Um, get her to walk through salt. So let's grab some stuff, get in the house, and see what we can do. We got our flashlight, our motion sensor, and a camera to start as always. It's my typical starting equipment when I go in. And of course we got a lovely rainy day. And sorry my allergies have been bad so my throat, my throat, yes I can talk today. My throat is a little froggy today. It's been a rough allergy time lately. Um, <clears throat> try to work around that a little bit if it's possible. I get the breaker on. Let's look and see. No summoning circle, no Ouija board. No signs of anything thrown around or anything like that. Let's come upstairs. And let's take a little cruise around. Nothing on the table. Nothing around the table, nothing on the counter. Nothing as yet in the kitchen area looking out of kilter, or off kilter. And let's walk through, no uh, voodoo doll. Right? No sign of the bone. And yes, sometimes it is on top of the car. Um, I agree, I was watching another very popular streamer of this game that I love to watch um, with his assessment that they really should rework um, how the spawning of the bone occurs. We have tarot cards. Because right now the bone apparently just is a random spawn so it can come in places that are like uh, there we go this one's not bad this one's just in the middle of the floor um but it can just spawn in randomly generated places so it can be like under the car in the car not in the car but per se but you know that is not normal that's not normal and it did it again so you're getting EMF3 and bunches of activity in here. Um, so yeah, looks like our ghost is in here. Um, I didn't mean to, that was me. Let's grab the EMF and see if we, there we go. Now we can see it a little better. This camera only, oh, well, let's not do that. Let's see if we can put it in the trash can. <laughs> do we have freezing? I don't think we have freezing. No, it doesn't look like it. All right, let's come over here. So we've got the cursed object, which is the tarot cards. We've got the bone. And we found the room. So, I don't know why that didn't count. It must have moved the cup or knocked something else that set off that EMF because I thought it was this, but we definitely got two of those, um, which I mean, it happens. You can't always tell exactly what it is unless you like pick up the object and throw it at the EMF, which does work by the way. Um, I forgot to look at my sanity, um, but we're not gonna be in there that long. Boy, it really likes that cup. Makes me sad I don't have a another camera this trip. All right, we're gonna do that, and we're gonna put this, and it's knocking on the window, and I can't take pictures of any of it. All right, let's do that. Alright, so I'm going to think we're going to have fingerprints because 
Like that. Sorry about that. Had to answer a call. Um, okay. Sanity. 73. Alright. Well, my first thought is Yuri, but I don't know. I mean, it could be a special ability of a different ghost that is making it go kind of wild like that. Um, I definitely want a camera. I definitely want to check the th that. And I definitely want to look for fingerprints. Um, and we munched on some pills. So let's go take a look. Oh, I forgot to look at the cameras. Camera. Single. Singular. All right, at this point, I don't see an orb. And yet I don't see uh, dots. So we will keep checking on that. We've got the book in there. And I'll be damned, it looks like it blew, blew the breaker. You painted my ass. Okay, so possible mare maybe? I don't know how long ago it was that it blew the breaker so I'm not going to try to take a photo of it because I think it's probably been too long. Can I get my thing picked up please? Alright, so let's come over here. Thirteen. Did you move? I think it moved. Uh, I think that's why. I think it moved. And that would explain why maybe it did that. All right, let's drop you for right now because I want my flashlight back. Figure out where it moved to. Up oh, here, freezing. I don't know how long ago you did that. All right, something got thrown in here. Wasn't that? It was probably one of these. Can turn this light back on now. And this light back on now. And that. Hello. Let me get back where I want keyboard. weird. It's a weird Chloe over there. I do see an orb though. Let's go get more stuff. So I'm gonna do the this. That means we have an orb to me but I need to check and make sure that it's not like something else. Do I have anything I left over here? No, that was just things that it was throwing around. Alright, so I have everything out of this room now. So now I need to find out that it is or isn't spirit box or fingerprints. So far, not right now. So we know it was freezing. I think I just saw dots. Let's go outside. And actually, I wanna bring this. Mm -mm. I don't 
what my issue is today with the buttons. Turn that off. All right, let's go outside. So I want to check for fingerprints again. It could be a legit orb. And I thought I might have seen dots, but let's look at the camera. And if this thing moved again, I swear. And why can't I see the orb? Because it was clear as day. Could be the camera or the dots. <laughs> I've been having issues with the dots. Oh, I did see dots. So that would be a Yuri, which I was thinking it was a Yuri. You just can't see the orb right now because the dots is in the way, but I saw it. There it is. Okay. So it's a Yuri, which my gut instinct was right. So salt crucifix motion sensor sanity is low. If it's a Yuri. Motion sensor salt. Take another camera in there. Um, I'll just take these in there and drop them. Well, drop the salt anyway. Okay, so now I can get the other, st other stuff, or some of it. Motion sensor's in there. I just need it to set it off. There it goes. Okay, so I need this. I look, I was in there for like a minute. It's crazy. I don't know how many salt footprints I'm going to be able to get with it. Hunting like that. Let's turn this on. I think they don't work on the frickin' rug. I brought the other one in here. I did. There's one. Walk in the other one. Come on. All right. 
we're done. Let's get out. Alright, so the rugs screwed up. That clearly is a footprint. There were two here, and it should have counted for two pictures. Although, okay, one of them counted here. It wasn't the blocks, and I don't know what the hell it moved. So we did get some pictures. Some of them got screwy. Um, let's see what our sanity is. 48! Whoa. Um, this could be bad. Does that count? It did. It counted. Whew, I don't have to go back in. I, I got lucky enough and put the first one right where it needed to be. Yay! I don't, I don't, don't ask me why I always feel like I need to put those away. So we got all the objectives. It's a Yuri. Just make sure I have it. Yes, I do have it there. A couple of the pictures got screwed up a lot. Or in part because of the fact that those rugs... And I've seen other streamers say that, that the rugs can mess up the pictures and I've experienced that myself multiple times. Welcome back. There's some jobs ready for you. Yuri. We hope you enjoyed this episode of the Trixie Show. Don't forget to subscribe, like, or even join Miss Trixie for all the upcoming shows.